Hello, welcome back to um, Hitman. We are now having technical internet difficulties, so who knows when this video will even be uploaded. Um, but it does preempty what I was going to do since, strangely enough, especially for those of us who live in areas where uh, internet access is not always as reliable as it is in other areas, um, rural type areas I should say, um, it is a bit odd that many, so many video games are, you have to connect the internet to do a lot of stuff on the games. In the case of Hitman, I can't even get a score if I'm not, if I can't connect to the internet. And considering how long this is taking to load, I may not even be able to play the game and you won't even hear this. Whoa. But then maybe you will. Anyway, I Marco am doing... Marco Abiati uh, is we. throwing a political rally at the beach to gain young voters. And getting close to him unnoticed might prove difficult. So pay attention. Men like Abiati always have private scores to settle, away from the public eye. Good luck, 47. So, yep, I'm here to take out a crooked politician. And that's him on the beach right in front of me. And I've obviously had a very, very difficult uh, night here. So, let's see. Huh. I think I hit the wrong button. Opportunities. Blah, blah, blah. Cheat sheet now. No. Dynamite smile. No absolution for the wicked. We will do that one. Just for the fun of it. So, the thing about this is it basically tells you exactly where to go when you do it. Anyway, what I thought I'd do is do kind of my wish list for the uh, upcoming Hitman 2, which, this is popular enough, I'm presuming there's going to be Hitman 2. Basically, going to make a wish list for what I want out of the second Hitman. Okay, let's... I don't Follow understand where the father is gone. Have you have you seen him? No, it's very strange. He's never acted like this before. But we need to find him. People are waiting for confession and maybe it's Abiati. What do you mean? He's looking for him too. And I heard rumors that they have history between them. Well, that doesn't mm. sound good. We need to find him. He needs to do his work. God's work. Yes. You're right. Okay. So I need to disguise myself as the good father. So, these I believe are actually locked. And let's see. They're both locked, so. Hmm. Does make for a challenge. Alright. I have the pick lots, so hopefully. Okay. Whew. I'm okay. This guy. What? It's going to be okay. They can subdue him. Anyway, this is a uh, wish list of um. Let's drag him out of the way here, just off to the side, so he's just not immediately visible. All right, let's see. Got the church key. And, yeah, should be fine. Uh, just of locations and places and things like that I'd like to see in Hitman 2. So, first off, we'll go with the uh, geographic locations and areas. Let's see. What button runs again? That's the running button. Okay. Okay, he's going... Okay, I think I can squeeze past him here. Whew. All right. Ah! What the heck? <laughs> that guy. Just when I think I'm out of it, they pull me right back in. Wait, no, that's Godfather. Never mind. So, um... That is uh, your target. Marco so, geographical locations that I'd like to see in Hitman 2. Um, obviously, since I'm here already, Alaska. That would be an awesome place to see it, to uh, have a level in, in Alaska. Um, li like to see England, actually. England, London, 
Wales would be a great place to have one, as would uh, Ireland. It's kind of my wish list. I used to live in Argentina, so I do like Argentina. So Argentina would be a fun one. Yes, actually anywhere in South America would, would be a pretty fun to have a hitman level. So those are kind of the geographical areas, but um, I was actually thinking of situation, lo location, situ situational locations. Anyway, um, not so much geographical as situational. So I thought actually a, a renaissance fair would be an interesting place to have a level. Uh, mainly because, you know, renaissance would be interesting. Hold on one second. <laughs> okay. Sorry, got a little sneezy thing going there. <laughs> ah, okay. Hope that wasn't too loud. I want to confess. I know I have sinned, but I want to make a fresh start. I'll see you in the confession booth. Don't let me down. Right, I'm heading to confession. So yeah, Renaissance Fair I think would provide for some very interesting opportunities. Plus you have a stockpile of, say, medieval-style weaponry there. So you've got a lot of um, choices. Let's see. Ah, I'm going to sit down. So you've got a lot of uh, choices in a medieval style um, area and level all kinds of different weapons and opportunities that could happen there. Thank you, Father, for seeing me. I've been looking oh, excuse me. I'm listening. Thank you, Father. Um, another an interesting area I, I think would be a prison. So hear me out on this one. So you have a prison. Your target's actually a I'm prisoner in the prison, so the you have to essentially, for the entire level, break into the prison without being detected, apology. take out the target, and but then leave. You can have multiple town. points of leaving from, it's you know, front door, um, as disguised as one of the guards, so without having, you know, screwed up your disguise, or maybe even an escape passage, or things like that. On your way to so, yeah, a prison, I think, would make for a very interesting, very challenging time, level. Francesco. And just for storyline-wise, things I want to throw in there. Um, I'd like to know more about the Shadow Client, more about, um, yeah, uh, what was it called? Uh, I can only think of Abstergo, and that's a completely different game. Um, Paradise? Providence, that's it, Providence. I'd like to know more about Providence and possibly even take um, Providence out. No so, problem. so yeah, that's my uh, that's the uh, my big uh, wish list. <sighs> Gonna have to hurry I past him because there's a guy who can spot me right there. The Vatican has always been fond of money. money so, is God. well, okay. God has simply taken another form. Okay, that's an interesting philosophy. That, but I must confess. All right, money is God, according to him, but. Yeah, um, yeah, gonna do an assassination type that on him just for making that statement. So, yeah, anyway, list of, uh, Hitman wish list for the next one, and I'll complete the assassination and be done with the video. Ah, lovely view of Sapienza. I should probably note this yes, takes sir. place two years before the normal mission. So. Hmm, wonder what's keeping him. Wow, he's out of shape. <coughs> Does it count as an assassination if he has a heart attack on the stairs? <laughs> okay, he's coming. So two years. So the G certain things have well, obviously I changed. I dare say, divine intervention is in order. Yeah, considering some of his comments and some of the stuff this guy's done. So there, there's a very obvious change that's about to be highlighted here because, yeah, that pillar was not in the later levels, and I think they removed it because of this assassination right there. So.
he said something about being able to fly, and now he's gone. So I don't know what's going on. Mr. Abiati, come out now. <laughs> Please come out. <laughs> yeah, I, I, you, you, you gotta love a, a security guard who says who, who thinks. Loses a target and and plays hide and seek with him. It's Mr. Abiati. Okay, so there's this guy. I'm going to probably have to run past him. Who are you, man? Ah, oh, darn it! He spotted me. Ah, oh, I thought I could get past him, but oh well. I'm gonna I'm gonna head up to these exits. So. I'm thinking that uh, that would be for Hitman if I could actually keep score <laughs> on this one. Uh, technology. So, regardless, Hitman wish list for Hitman Season 2. Hopefully we'll get all that and find out more about the mysterious other people. But yeah, since that last guy spotted me, it, it's for Hitman. Yay me. I, I just... I just don't look too much like a, um, yeah, priest when I'm dressed like that. Anyway, uh, like and subscribe uh, if you liked it, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.